Welcome to tutorial number six about how to know the defined and the undefined sketches. So let's first choose one plane, top plane, and enter the sketch mode. And now let's sketch a triangle in any place. Okay, so as we notice, the re rectangle is shown in the blue color so the blue color means that the rectangle is still not defined and here we also notice under undefined undefined rectangle so now to define the rectangle we need to add some dimensions and some position in the between the axes so let's add dimension as we know from the previous tutorial smart dimension and now let's add dimension here and another dimension on the second line okay and we see still the rectangle still not defined that means we have to define its position between the axes so now we have the x z axis so we can define its position to that axis for example I can make the dimension between the z axis and the rectangle to be 50 and the distance between the rectangle and x axis to be 50 as well so now we have the rectangles fully defined and again I can try that with the circle Add smart dimension eighty millimeter and now I can add a relation between the center point of the circle and the origin to be control control add relation to be coincident so now we have the circle in the black color that means it is fully defined also if I draw a circle on this point coincident to this point rectangle corner it will be already defined the, the position yes we need to add a dimension to it then we have defined circle so now I can set this sketch and now let's add another sketch and use the fully defined tool which define the sketch so now let's now take the front plane enter the sketch normal tool and let's draw a rectangle here and a circle and under here we have the fully defined sketch we just click on that calculate it will automatically define the sketches So now I can close this tutorial about defining the sketches and see you in the next tutorial.